If your shoulders need a massage, well, I can come over or you can pick up this. What's happening, Panda Nation? Peter Von Panda here. Who doesn't like a nice shoulder massage? Now, I have used a lot of massagers in the past, and the big problem is getting the shoulders done. A lot of them are just kind of pressed up against your back, or your legs. They kind of just knead like this. It's like rollers that go up and down and stuff. But this one seemed a little bit unique in that it would go over your shoulders, kind of work the back of the neck, which is something that I feel like a lot of them don't do. But I was hoping that, man, I could get a nice, deep, relaxing massage on my shoulders and not break the bank and not have to go to my favorite massage parlor all the time. So here's what we get. It kind of looks like a headrest on a first class seat on an airplane, but we've got this nice vinyl. It's gray on the outside here. It's actually got some weight to it. So I am expecting this to be decently beefy. And then we have this strap that goes all the way up here. And that's actually to kind of clamp it down so that the pressure is where you need it. And then on this side, we get some massaging arms. You can see the top piece here and then the lower ones there. So that's a hardware piece of it. And we also get a charging cable. So USB-A to USB-C right there. So the first thing I want to show you is that the charging port is on the inside here. So you can see it right there. Now, even though I got this for my neck, as I was looking through the instructions, you can actually use this for a lot of different places. You can actually put it on your lower back, kind of strap it around your midsection. You can put it on your legs and strap it around your legs. So it's actually not just a neck massager, but that's why I got it. So let's get to massaging the neck. So first of all, I'm going to go ahead and just put it up here. I'm going to put the big arms kind of right on the back of my neck. You can see the little kind of pegs are kind of pressed into my back right there. I'm going to kind of pull this around like this. It actually says to kind of clamp it around your back there. So you could absolutely do that. There are some elastic like extensions, so you can probably make this pretty tight. But on the side here, and this is actually not super easy to see when it's on, but this is where your control buttons are. So we have the power button, the massage mode, heating, and then the speed right there. So you just kind of have to memorize those, I guess. And so as you put this on, you gotta be a little limber to get it clipped on here. All right, got it clipped on there, okay. So now I'm just gonna hit the power on button, hold it down for a few seconds. Oh, there it goes. Oh. 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 Oh yeah. Oh my gosh, that feels so good. Oh, it's kind of tight. You know what? And it kind of has that pressure that hurts a little bit, like actual human hands and what I'm comparing this to are just like the roller spinning massagers, which, you know, you can really press into, put your body weight on them, but they don't really get as deep as you want because the pressure is just kind of diffused, you know? I mean, oh, this is really getting it. Oh my gosh. Oh yeah, that feels so good. Dude, I bet this feels so good on the lower back, on your legs, on the 26 inch pythons, you know what I'm saying? All right. I'll tell you what, just in that standard mode, that feels pretty good. But I'm going to go down here and hit the power button for the mode. Oh, and it's kind of doing like a zzz, zzz, zzz. It's going through the same motions, but just kind of like at one frame a second. So it's a little less intense, but man, that feels good. All right, let's try the next mode. Maybe it's just got two modes. Maybe that's it. But now if I hit the heating button, probably has a little heating there. I've got it on that continuous mode, and I'm just going to hit the speed button now. Oh, yeah. Okay, so that's like slow. It's a pretty medium or fast. Oh, I like the fast. I like it continuous. Oh my gosh, that feels so good. I tell you what, this thing is head and shoulders above the other massagers I've had. And I've loved the other massagers, you know, to get a little bit of working of the muscles feels so good. Get some blood flowing, kind of relaxes some tense muscles. But most of the time, like I said, on your shoulders, on your neck, you just don't get that nice, deep, like tissue massage. So this thing is incredible. I don't know how I didn't discover this earlier. I tell you what, look a little hunchback right now, but man, I could just sit in any chair. You don't need a massage chair. Take this with you on a trip. I bet this would be awesome on road trips. Throw on a long airplane ride. You know, kind of work out the kinks. Kind of work out that crick in your neck after sleeping, whatever. Oh, my gosh. This and a old-fashioned would be just about heaven right now. Hey, if you want to pick up this neck massager, I am absolutely digging this thing. I'll put a link to it in the description below. Peter Von Panda. Out. Oh, yeah.
Oh, sweet mama.